this earlier. Clarence, if you're watching this video, stop now. Oh my god, oh my god, no. We need to put a disclaimer from the from the Family. future. From the past. From the future. So I mean, so we need to put it early on. The first one. Okay, I just want to have a disclaimer. Any of our family, if you're watching this right now, please stop watching. It's actually really weird if you continue watching after this disclaimer because we've specifically told you not to watch it. So, don't. so please have some respect for our privacy. Yeah. And honestly, if you ever tell us about this video, we're gonna be, both be really mad yes. that you've even brought it up because yes. we're telling you right now. Yes. If you're any family member, cousin, brother, sister, mother, father, do not watch this video any further Cause that's our disclaimer fun. from the future goodbye let's get back to the video <laughs> it's cold outside but the fire keeps us warm we can spend the night underneath the mistletoe and i've gotten you a present that i put under the tree tomorrow it is christmas What's up, AM fam? Welcome back to our channel. Cheers to Christmas. Cheers to Christmas, baby. And today, obviously, we are doing a truth or drink. <laughs> drink, truth or drink. And I was drinking, even though I didn't need to, but I'm gonna enjoy this because this is our first glass. And hopefully we don't have to drink too much of it. Hopefully. But to be honest, we're probably gonna drink this afterwards anyway. It doesn't probably really matter. Throughout, throughout talking and... Yes. How much is in your bank account? How much is in our, my bank account? Yeah. Our bank account? Our bank account. <laughs> we don't have a bank account. <laughs> well, our we have... in total, in our bank account. Oh, oh together. Yeah, yeah. Right. I guess the drinking is important. Yeah, because it should just be, it'll just be embarrassing, won't it? This is not, we're not, we're, this is not something we're bragging about. This no, is not a bragging situation. It's not, it's not a bragging situation. It's not, a bragging situation. <laughs> it's not a bragging situation. It's not that bad, but it's not like it's, it's, not, it's not, not something that is so high that we feel bad to tell you guys, yeah. to be honest. Yeah. Anyway. It just goes between a million and a <laughs> I freaking wish. Do you think we'd be in, in this studio right now? No, you're definitely not a million. Not even no, close. I have a house right now if we. and a dog. Mm -hmm. And probably a baby. And a car. Oh, priorities. <laughs> no. We would definitely have a house. Right. A dog and then a baby. Not a car? If we had a million dollars in our back account. Not a car. Well, yeah, we'll get a car, of course. We get <laughs> My girl, you don't care about the house, the dog, or the baby. All you care about is the car. You don't even drive. She doesn't even drive. <laughs> Next person. Did I drink? No, I didn't. You better. Okay. Ooh. What do you dislike about me? What I like about you is when you take zero, <laughs> zero responsibility for your actions. <laughs> See, here's something you dislike. That's it. That's all I have to say. Your turn. <laughs> when you don't admit that you're wrong. Okay, moving on. I'm just gonna drink it away. Moving on. <laughs> Why? I think I need a drink as well. By the way, we started this video straight from a sort of an argument. Well, you get. I'm sure you guess what the argument is about. <laughs> Her not taking responsibility. Zero. She's anyway. Wrong. Who do you think <laughs> would be happy if we divorced? You. What? 100%. What? I would be happy if we divorced. Oh! No, I don't think you'd be happy, but neither of us would be happy. Right. But I think you would be happier sooner. I think you would have a chance of being happier than I would. I, cause I didn't think the question was who would be happy about the divorce. I can't imagine that either of us would be happy about mm -hmm. the divorce. So I think that right. if, who would be happy again? Yeah. And sooner. So you think I would be happy again sooner? Compared yes. to you. Yes, 100%. That's 100% how I feel. 100%. Why? Uh, for many reasons. Like? I can't tell you all of them. Then you need to drink. No, that's not the question. That's the next question underneath. What's Hold the next up. question? Why do you think... Let me see it. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> She's lying. Oh my god, I caught you lying. So why do you think it would be me? Oh Tell me a reason. That's not the question. Tell me a reason. I'll answer you, but I should have to drink for that because that's not a question on your Tell list. Tell me a reason. No, I'll, I'll, uh, um, why do I think you'll be happier sooner? Um, I, I, I am more. I'm not more emotional. I think I take things a lot harder. I, if any, I tend to spiral. 
into the deep, mm. dark holes that are really hard for me to come out of. And then I make a lot of bad decisions after that spiraling. I'm really mad at everything. I think that it would be really hard for me to ever move on from you. Aww. I feel the same way about myself. I know, baby, but you asked me. <laughs> I, I, was just, I was just saying my opinion. That's okay. I think it would be That's really okay. hard for both of us, by the way. Mm -hmm. I, I, neither of us would be happy about a divorce. We're never going to get divorced. But if we did, we would both be devastated because neither of us believe in divorce. That was something we talked about before we got married. We yeah. talked about the fact that divorce is like a no, no, no. We, we hate the idea of it. Mm -hmm. um, it obviously, get divorced if you're in an unhealthy relationship and be yeah. happy with your life. Yeah. We're not giving that advice yeah. at, all. Not at all. But we knew that we wanted, we knew that marriage was super important to both of us mm -hmm. and getting divorced would be a devastating, devastating thing. Yeah, we'd both be upset about it, but if you are, if you, if I had to answer that gun to my head, which there was no gun to my head and I happily answered it, but <laughs> <laughs> there was only a drink, I could have had a sip of wine, but <laughs> if I had to answer it, I would say that I think you would get over it eventually sooner. Okay. And when I say sooner, I mean it could take you years, right. but I think it would take me a still lifetime. Still sooner than me. Still sooner than me. Okay. And you, what's your answer? Really? I think you, yeah. You think I would get over yeah, it sooner? Yeah, because you'll move on faster than I would. I don't think I will ever move on. I get that, but, but you eventually. Think, and yeah. I also think you think you wouldn't move on, but I think you would I'm as well. I think move on, okay. Oh, <laughs> but the point is that we are cute. <laughs> yeah, we're cute. We're it's cute. Me. Which family member of each other you dislike the most? You already know this. I don't know this. Which of your family members I dislike the most? Yeah. That's easy. Are you gonna say it? Because the people watch this video? <laughs> I love them all, but if I had to choose one. I'm gonna drink for mine. <laughs> if you had to choose one, by the way, I'm not saying I dislike any members of your family. I love them all. It's your family. Your family is my family. That's how it is, right? Mm -hmm. You marry into, so you get married to someone. Their family becomes your family. But if, like, again, gun to my head. I don't have a gun to my head. But if I have a gun to my head, that's how you have to play this game. You have to play this game like really serious because they really want us to answer these questions or if we don't answer it it's, it's really hard for us mm -hmm. you know what i mean so you really gotta like yeah clearly it wasn't hard for me to answer that it was it wasn't you know my answer i know your answer as well you know my answer yes which is of your family I if I had to pick either. one that I like the least <laughs> but I like them all right so let's rank it here in this scale this is the love scale so we love them all but if you had to put it in the order of who you love the most so who you love the least but you love them all anyway she just answered by the way as well behind the scenes I <laughs> just want to say that I told you when you asked me today if if I wasn't gonna answer all you're like obviously some of them you're not gonna answer and I was like no Honey, I am coming for I'm still drinking your wine. I am coming out guns blazing with this video. Okay, I didn't say this one then. What's the dirtiest nude you ever sent? What's the dirtiest nude I ever sent? Mm -hmm. What am I supposed to do? Show it to them? Just describe it. Describe it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I feel like this one. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I just gave that whole speech about how I'm coming out guns blazing and I'm gonna answer every question. <laughs> and then as the next question I drink, no, I'm gonna answer this. So first I have to think about it because I've sent some in some. my life. I've sent some in my lifetime. Mm -hmm. But the dirtiest, how will I remember? Obviously something where I was completely naked, right? Mm -hmm. Because I'm assuming, I didn't, I'm not saying that's the hottest one I've sent. The dirtiest. The dirtiest, one. probably, pre, probably completely naked and like doing something to myself. <laughs> You can answer. 
I mean, honestly, it's the same thing as you. This no, no, really forget it. Detail. Move on, move on. Next question. You're not gonna take. You're not gonna feed off of my bravery. You're not gonna ride on the back of my bravery. Like honestly, same. Honestly, same. I'm gonna ride. Yeah. <laughs> What's the most public space you have done stuff in? Um, well, in a bar, mm -hmm. in the bathroom of a toilet, mm -hmm. in a bar, in a pub. Mm -hmm. um, I've also done it in the back of a truck, a, van, a truck, you know, with, with the trunk of the truck, like open. Um, I will pop up a, a picture of what that vehicle is that I'm talking about. Thanks. <laughs> Just on the screen there so you understand. It's not a van, it's a truck. And in, in, the, in the forest. There's Be more people around there, so it's not very public. Behind an airport. Okay. Directly behind it where the planes are landing. N near to a beach where people can walk. <gasps> and uh, very close to the road where I cars are driving. I have done it. Uh, in a university. No, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I, I'm. <laughs> and I am so mad. In a Can you stop using that example? It's a public place. You do not do in anything. A cinema. You do not really do anything. Anything. In a cinema. Because that was my ex, that's so why she's talking like this. Uh, in a cinema. No shit. It was your ex. Did you have to say <laughs> it? Did you have to say it again? <laughs> Uh, in a pub, yeah, it's a public place. Not that. <laughs> when was the last time you smoked a cigarette? Mine was about three weeks ago. Or four weeks ago. What? We shot one cigarette together, remember? Oh, okay, mine was about two weeks ago. We don't smoke. We don't. It's no, always been bad. No, we really don't. I um, accidentally, yeah. a couple times in the last month, accidentally fell Once into one cigarette. that was lit. <laughs> and I had gasped for air because I fell, so it was like a shock. So I was like, <gasps> and, and I inhaled. And then, shit, it was an accident. That happened to me a few times, maybe three or four times this past month. That's how it happened for me. And the other day we were out, maybe three weeks ago, when I say the other day, it could mean from now to like a year or two <laughs> years ago. So the other day, like three weeks ago, we were out and we were like, damn, it's been about three years since we smoked a cigarette because we quit. Can you tell them that, about the smoking and how I made us stop smoking? You did. You told me the camera. She, as one day she came back, no more smoking and we legit stopped. No, three years. No, no, no. I smoke, babe, but that's not exactly how it happened. You continue smoking a little bit here and there. Oh, and yeah. I would always I be did. like, you really should stop. Yeah. That continued on for about a few months of me not smoking. Yeah. The first time I told you, you didn't decide you were going to quit right away. You eventually decided to quit when you saw how good it was that I actually was able to stop. You felt motivated by me. So then you eventually stopped several months later. Disclaimer I was never buying a package. I no, yeah. always get cigarettes from people. Same. That's what we're talking about. 100%. Both of us. We Both. never were the ones to buy a pack. We are amateur smokers. Completely. We would never smoke buying our own packs, really. The many made me sound now sounded like I was like a smoker. And no, like, no. <laughs> we, did it, we did it socially. But anyway, the point is three weeks ago, we were like, what the heck? It's been a long time. Yeah. Let's just ask someone for one. We were, we were, we were drunk, obviously, as you can imagine. We were out. Yeah. So we asked someone for one, they, they gave us a, one of those really long skinny ones. Mm -hmm. We absolutely hated it and we had a couple of pulse drops on the ground. I was like, thank god we don't smoke, we didn't do it again. No, and then we well, picked it up and then we put I, it in the ashtray. We put it in the ashtray but then a week after that I fell on the cigarette, I told you how it happened. And that's how I accidentally smoked. Smoked again. But we are never going to smoke again, we're both, we don't smoke. We don't smoke. So it was just, smoke. This just kind of mistakenly happened yeah. in this period of a month. Yeah. That's why I guess you put that question in there. Yes. To, 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 to see if you <sighs> answer that answer. question or not. Go ahead. Out of all of your exes, who is the best in bed? Alright, clearly I had one. You have to answer this question yeah, as well. I only <laughs> had one ex. Okay, well, take away the exes and talk about all the, all the people you slept with. Let's, let's do it with the, all the girls you slept with. Okay, let's go with that. Then. Besides me, this question. Besides you. This question is besides us. Yes. Jesus that's what that's what makes it hard, obviously, because then I would just say you as well. It's an easy answer. 
don't even know. I don't even, you know what? I can't even answer that question. Because I don't have one that I think is the best. Ooh. I have a few that I think were all good in different ways. Mm. But I didn't, I, none, not one of them stood out to me as the best. I feel uh, like right. a few of the ones that were good to me were on kind of the same level. Right. So, yeah. Yeah. Until you find me. Until you, if I could save you, I would save you. Okay. Good. What's the longest you've been without showering? A day. Okay. You? Yeah, we both know you're the unhygienic one. <laughs> we, we all we all know it. <laughs> and the AM family. In my defense. Mm. What was the last time you fought about someone else while having sex with me? 